It's someone's birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Kenny. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, mate. Sorry about that. Here we are for a shave, a special shave. It's um, Ken Lee's birthday. So this is gonna be um, a shave using uh, what I could find that uh, Ken has got. So uh, I've also got a special guest here today. It's Ken's sister, Rosie Lee. Cup of tea. Just to wet the whistle. Right, what we're going to be using today, the Mocha Progress short handle, and I've got set in that. Um, I'm sure uh, Ken's used this blade before, it's the Perma Sharp stainless. Make sure you get that the right way around. Yep. They'll be on set and two for the first two passes. Um, find it and then one maybe for the uh, third and touch-ups uh, got the big Bruce in today g'day Cobber how you doing got a couple of shrimps on the barbie uh, soap is going to be soap commander vision one of his uh, favorite of the favorite soap commander soaps which is uh, aqua, amber and mint. You can see I've taken a few samples out there for people. So load from a dry puck today. Um, post shave is going to be Thayer's Witch Hazel Lavender. Splash. Might do it in a video or leave it um, for later on. Uh, that will be the uh, aqua velva ice blue. And I've got the balm, which I haven't used since I got it uh, on my birthday last year, in November. So it'll be the first time using that. So okay, let's start the shave. I'm shaving a day earlier than uh, I would normally, because uh, I want to get this out on Ken's birthday. <clears throat> right. This uh, I've been playing around with this brush because it's such a big knot. That's the uh, the Razor Rock one, which is supposed to be 26 mil. And I've got the uh, Cadman four-sided. Looks similar, but this one looks slightly bigger. So I'm not sure if this is a 26 or a 24 or well, this. I did measure this, but didn't sort of measure up to a uh, 26 mil. But uh, here we are. Um, I shaved on the uh, Tuesday. I don't know when I done my last uh, short video, because I'd had four days growth and I couldn't really wait another couple of days. So, so what I do is put it under the water and just give it a little shake like that, and then load. Um, we used the wick of, um, the razor rock soap on Tuesday, and uh, I think I shook too much uh, of the water out because it's a, a bigger knot than I'm used to. So I came home. I think that was early hours Wednesday morning, and uh, grabbed the soap. And sort of tried you know, just a little shake of the brush to leave a little bit of water in there. So if you shake it too hard, you shake all the water out because the synthetics obviously don't hold um, any water. So hopefully that's enough on there. We used the soap commander soap for a while, especially this one.
I was actually kind of leaving it because um, I knew I wanted to use this soap on this day. So. How your shades been getting on then since I saw you last? And I uh, shaved the back of my neck uh, yesterday with the um, that Bailey uh, twister open, the uh, feather blade, that's quite. Quite a nice, pleasant shave actually. And you sort of go with the grain and then against the grain. There's no, no irritation, nothing. And thanks uh, for those that um, sent me well wishes. Uh, not feeling as bad today, but not completely over it. I woke up yesterday with a, a really bad headache. So it's not, not been a, a good week so far. So I think I'm over the worst. Right, uh, set and two, two days growth. As this is a Ken Lee's uh, video, I better do the forearm in the, in the shot, isn't I? That forearm in there. Might be a good birthday, Ken. And if you're going out for a meal or uh, you're waiting and waiting till the weekend. Hope you have a nice, lovely shave on your birthday. Sorry about the singing at the start. It's, uh, it's not really my thing, but um, as it's his, as it's your birthday, mate. Step out of my comfort zone for you. You know that um, Old Innsbruck, it's a nice scent. I said I'd pick up a sort of a floral note. Um, Shavathon left a, um, a link to uh, 
Amazon.com. Um, so I could read sort of reviews of the uh, Old Innsbruck. And um, somebody said um, in one of the reviews that it's not a tobacco leaf scent, it's the um, scent of the tobacco um, flower. Which will make sense because that's that sort of floral scent I picked up. Nice first pass. Rosie Lee. I think why I call it Rosie Lee is yes, um, this co Cockney rhyming slang, uh, Rosie Lee tea. Oops. I'm really liking this brush. Uh, sold by Rod Neep silver tip brush. I uh, posted that out yesterday. And I've also got um, got a couple of more Barrister Man soaps on their way. So yeah, that'll be increased by a third. And from four to six. I tried to get another one on the uh, UK buy sell trade, but that um, missed out on that one. Right, so two again. Across the grain. If you uh, do leave a comment in the um, comments box, comment box below. Can you tell me if you prefer the uh, shorter videos I do on Tuesday, or do you prefer the ones, I, the longer ones I do on a Friday? Well, on a Friday as a rule. As I said, I'm shaving the day earlier today, uh, this week. I can get this um, video up in time. A uh, new subscriber uh, commented the other day that um, my what I do on a Tuesday, I'm I'm lazy. Um, why do I? Cut my shaves short on a Tuesday. I 
and I told him I, I work nights and uh, by the time I've if it's, a, if it's if it's a full video then I've got to edit it watch it if there's any mistakes I'd like to put some text in there to correct it um, I've got to save it on my iPod then I've got to transfer it to my laptop and then upload it and with the Friday shave I can I've got a little bit more time because that's the end of the week and uh, when I finish into early hours of um, Friday morning I can uh, I've got that extra time to sort it out But we'll see. No Tuesday worked all of Monday night. Come home early hours Tuesday morning, sleep, get up. And I've got to get that. I've got a short window of um, getting up, waking up, and then uh, having, my having breakfast, having my shower. And I've got to get the video um, set up, uh, record it, and you know before the children come home from school, because um, I don't like sort of any interruptions when I'm videoing, any distractions. So then I've got to, I've got to pack everything away. I've got to wash all my shave stuff down. Seem to be like the two percent of people that watch don't really know what goes into making a, a video. I know a lot of you um, watch and appreciate my videos, which is much appreciated. And I'll do what I can for you. But for someone that co uh, comes along, and they, they don't make videos themselves it's easy, easy for them to sit back and uh, point the finger now, as uh, TSC says on his video it's his channel he'll do it the way he, he wants to do it you either like it or you go somewhere else I've got a couple of weepers there Ken for you My pleasure.
We have to do the uh, Ken Lee against the grain. And he put him the other Ken. I don't know if you saw my uh, previous well, video I done last week. My favourite creams and soaps, the um, Mitchell's Wool Fat. You saw that was kind of shrinking. Um, but the other one, I uh, came home, had the idea of grating it, grating the puck right down, and then pushing it down into the uh, ceramic dish. So there's no, there's no movement there now. Push it into the bottom of the dish and then you get the, uh, well, a full dish. I think I remember the uh, stallion saying in his, one of his videos um, he just bought a second puck, grated it down and then packed it, packed the original um, puck um, into the ceramic bowl. So in fact, effectively you've got two lots of uh, soap in there. I was talking about, uh, well, not talking about, talking to uh, Michael Friedberg. Um, I'd have to comment on one of his videos. He was talking about, you know, going against the grain on the chin. And uh, people got it in their mind, they've got to go straight up when it comes to going against the grain on the chin, but um, you don't have to. You know, like Paul H does the. Um, he goes in from the side and then gradually turn it so it's uh, by the time he gets to the centre is it is sort of going straight up. But so uh, you can you can do the sort of the same on the chin, come in from the side and then gradually work it because the, the growth obviously goes this way, doesn't it? On most people anyway. Another double sip.
I've, I've said before, but I don't know why the uh, hair around your, you know, on the top lip and on your chin, why is that more coarse than um, anywhere else on the face? Don't know if it's more coarse, it's more sort of dense. There we go, I'll just rinse off with cold water now. Got these little weavers because I've uh, shaved too early. A bit of a sting there. Another shave on uh, Sunday. I've been invited to um, a Facebook group event. It's um, Jason Rodman's birthday. So, for that one, I'll just be uh, <clears throat> posting my uh, Facebook pics, shave of the days, and uh, on Instagram, Twitter. Slap on some flares. And that's uh, drying down. Let's go over the uh, stars of the shave. Let's see a Merc progress short handle. With the uh, perma sharp. Not sure what shave that. How many shaves that is now? Maybe, probably three. I guess I'll have to check. The uh, razor rock plus soft style knot. That's the big Bruce. Good day, Cobb. Put a few shrimps on the barbie. What's that? Not stereotyping Australians at all, am I? <laughs> uh, ah, Thayer's cucumber I put on. Soap was uh, Soap Command Division. Let's put some, uh, stick it on now, I think. I'll probably get a little burn from it. Aqua Velvet Ice Blue. Okay, that's got a, uh, large hole in the top there so what I do is just plug the hole and then uh, just leave a little open so I can get enough out get a nice menthol kick at the end with that uh, old Innsbruck you slap that on um, smelling the scent and then all of a sudden this uh, burst of uh, menthol hits your face. It's fantastic. And the scent lasts quite a while as well. 
and uh, finishing off with the um, Soap Commander Vision Balm. I'm sure this is ever never tried before. Not sure if that's enough. Should be enough. I know in some other videos I've seen, you don't have to use. Oh, yeah, look. <laughs> Looks like a ghost. And pale enough as it is. Okay. Yeah, I think I use it about twice as much as I should. Never mind. You get the mental kick from that as well. Cool. There you go, it's soaking. Ooh. I like to stand outside on a frosty day. Oof. There you go, Ken. Cheers to you, mate. Have a good birthday. Uh, whatever you're doing. Um, so there you go. That's my birthday shave to Ken Lee. Um, thanks for watching. Thanks for your likes, comments. Uh, any questions, leave them in the comments box below. Uh, don't forget to uh, click on the, um, the bell uh, icon for uh, any future notifications and videos. And uh, I'll see you middle of next week, I think, now. So have a great weekend, have some great shows, and I'll see you then. Cheers, bye.